combat through unfamiliar marshy terrain against the volunteer citizen militia had taken its toll. Yggdra had doubts about the justice she fought for, but continued nevertheless with the holy sword in hand. The royal army defeated an injured Crimson Princess Emilia to end the Battle of Draminos Marsh. Past there, the imperial capital of Flareorc was a stone's throw away. The royal army advanced with all speed to hasten the end of the war. The gigantic Ark of Triumph protecting the imperial capital was an impassable barrier that had stymied all invaders since the founding of the empire. Golkas's elite imperial knights had fortified the front lines and court magician Yudi provided backup from the top of the gate. My report, sir. At Dromino's Marsh, General Amelia was... She was killed in combat, sir. <gasps> she fought bravely, until the last. I understand. Please leave me. Y yes sir Forgive me, Amelia. I have failed as a brother if I could not save my own kin. Attendants! To me! Yes, my lord! I am taking to the field! Gather my men! Yes, sir! Look! That's... Golkasa, the Emperor of Carnage. Princess Yggdra, I salute your making it here! Hear me, Emperor! A world forged in blood only brings more suffering. We have seen enough sacrifice. Lay down your weapons. If you do, I swear that your people will not be harmed. <laughs> Is that all you came here to say? What an arduous journey for such a ridiculous request. Even were I to believe you, we would never accept your terms. You doubt my words? We raised your kingdom, and you have responded in kind. How are we to extinguish our flames of hatred now? This fighting cannot end until one of us can fight no more! But... Our resolve is as firm as yours. We will not yield. We have long since passed the point of no return, Princess. So much for negotiation. You tried, Princess, but we must prepare for battle now. Princess? Must we? Is there no other way? Is the sword the only means of carving a path? My sole aim is a peaceful world, free of borders. Princess. But to tear down these borders, blood must be spilt. Why is that? Princess, compose yourself. You cannot falter now. But I... Here they come! Find that things will not be so easy this time. Prepare yourself, Princess Igdra!
I challenge you! <laughs> I thought you were through with us! Kilie? You said it yourself, Princess. You can't turn back now. You've got a responsibility to the people. I said there's no such thing as absolute justice, but... You have to believe that your justice is worth fighting for. If you don't, where do those who believe in you end up? The ones who lost their lives fighting for your cause? That's... Why hesitate now? I thought you'd take responsibility. Think about Milanor and all the others here following you. They all believe in you. Uh... Stop crying. Milanor and your men need a leader. Kilie. I'll pitch in this one last time, Milanor. You guys would fall apart without me. Thanks, I think. What brought you here anyway? I don't know. I just thought, better you than Golkasa. Huh? What did you say? Oh, nothing. It doesn't matter. Come on, the enemy's coming. Those onks are a real nuisance. Bad enough when it was just one of them, but this is nuts! Milanor and the princess will never last at this rate. Hmm. If I could just take out those onks somehow, Milanor would be able to get through.
minds made up. Milanor, hang in there. Huh? Sheesh, Killy, hey, you don't need to tell me. Huh? What are those tears for? I'm gonna clear the way for you. Don't tell me you're... No! Don't do this, Killie! Stop! Come on, Al. One last time. Lady Killie. No! That idiot. How could she? <sighs> the path is clear. All troops advance! What? Are you going to stand there and waste Killie's sacrifice? Don't look back! Go! Go! Beat the gatekeepers and we've got a shot at this! Get it together and let's go! You're right! Advance!
has been breached I see I'm not entirely surprised the final battle is here it's time I made my presence felt ready the troops we'll lure the enemy onto our ground yes sir <laughs> 